on, I'm going to show you how to make this Facebook cover in Canva.com. So, the first thing you want to go to is click on the Canva icon, go down to the plus sign, from there scroll down to social media and email header. Click on the Facebook cover. And that will bring up a blank template of the right proportion dimension inside. So from here, you can see at the side they have pre-made templates that you can pay for or you can choose one of the free ones or you can upload your own. I have a few uploaded. Uh, so let's use this one. I like to get some of my graphics from unsplash.com. They have free high resolution graphics so you just click and drag over. Uh, it's not the right size, but all you have to do is click on the black dot, you see arrows, press down and pull, press down and pull to fit your header, doesn't matter if it goes over, and that looks nice. And then from there we want to add a circle. A transparent circle. So we'll head on over and click on text. We'll scroll down. Till we get to the one that I need on the header. And it is transparent horizon. Just drag and pull it over. Place it in the middle. You should see a line that's in the middle. Alright, and then from there we're going to go to elements. Click on line. In this very first one, we're going to click and drag right to the bottom. And we're going to Pull it to the very end, pull it on the side to the very end, and you can change the color to, color to black. So right up here in the corner, click on black. And the reason I like doing this is because it covers up that your name and your, on your header in Facebook and the little buttons that they have on the side there just makes it look a little bit more clear. All right, so let's go back to this circle. Let's delete the text. So press on it. Uh, press delete. Press the other one. Press delete. It needs to highlight to press delete. And let's add in some text. Go up. And we'll click on heading, drag it over, place it in the middle, I'll copy that. We'll have C, and then we'll add in our text. Click on highlight, and then let's do every delete. Oh, Text. 
click on it over here in the corner left hand corner it will have um text that can pick pick Allura Allura um this one And change the color of the circle by clicking on it, going to the checkerboard in the inner corner, and pushing transparency down to let's say 60%. And we'll change the color of the circle to white by clicking up in the corner, going down. Clicking on white. Let's make the circle a little bit darker. Clicking on transparency. Make it 65. Uh, and now click on your background. Click on the circle board to me again. And we'll make it a little bit transparent. Let's make it. And click on your circle, we'll make it a little bit smaller. And there you go. We have a beautiful Facebook timeline cover. And let's download it. Click on download. Click on the green download button. And that's it. That's how easy it is. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'm going to be doing a lot more.